right, so continuing on with the theme of proper scouting, we're gonna take a rundown smooth operator. And this one, this one has a problem with wind down near the bottom. There's a, there's a set of tables. There's a lot of wind that comes in from the right side. So I have to be wary of that in my mind. But just looking at it, it doesn't look blown out. It doesn't look too loose. So should be pretty much safe to send, but I'm still gonna take it just a little bit easy. So let's see what it looks like. See if they change anything. Ooh, this looks nice. Definitely can feel the wind though. Definitely. A little speed whoop. Oh, so many braking bumps. That is ridiculous. All right, into the big wall. Super fun. Not really hard at all. This is where we get, a, get into that wind tunnel. You can really hear it. Oh, that is loose. No traction. Oh, all right. I just really don't, I don't want to get affected by this wind. Not too bad. Oh, put the foot down. Woo! Sending it. All right, last jump. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it was fun. It's funny in Kamikaze games, this little rocky end section was the end of the stage. My girlfriend was down there. Man, she said so many people ate it. It was crazy. So sometimes it's the things that don't look too bad that will take you down. So let's head down to the shuttle. So we're here at the top of Shotgun. Take a quick ride down, see what it's looking like. Oh, it seems like that rock is there every year. I don't know, maybe I'm just imagining things, but it always seems like that rock is there. Oh, geez, so loose. Back more, I think. Good. 
So a little bonus tip, always make sure if you took your goggles off, no debris or rocks got inside the goggle. I got caught yesterday riding a trail and a rock had made its way into my goggles and made it into my eye. And it actually made its way into my dominant eye and I had to close my eyes and do a jump with my eyes closed, which uh, wasn't optimal. So make sure all that, that stuff is out, make sure they're clean, ready to rock and roll.